Tracks. Help us. Where are you leading us, girl? So, what do you want to do now? We don't have to go straight home, do we? Look! Tracks from the olfactorily gifted hound. Seems we're on the right path. Hey, girl, we're here. Guess we should follow her. More paw prints. Little slobber balls, quite the tracker. More of Helka's tracks. I dare say she's got as skilled a nose for hunting as you, brother. Hers is superior. The eyes can lie. The nose cannot. Does that make you wish you could turn into an animal every mm. once in a while? No. And there she goes. Looks like we're on Halka's trail. Ah, she went over that ridge. But we can't follow her at this time of night. Can't be far now. The flare. That's gotta be Birger. She wants us to rescue him. You can head back now, Halka. We'll take it from here. How could Birger have survived a fall like that? Magic, perhaps. Let's make sure to ask once we've extricated him from this situation. Should be easy to find Birger from up here. Why'd everyone sound so scared of this place? Uh, on that note, Dragon! <laughs> I'm fine. You? Hmm. Well, he seemed angry. What do you suppose that means? We are going the right way. Where are we anyway? Looks to be the ruins of a once thriving Vanier settlement. What happened? Don't rightly know. More reason to find a way out. Signal! Yuger's alive! Not for long if that dragon has its way. 
It will not. Do you see what I'm seeing? A lightning bolt. Except it's frozen? Like the one made in my fight with Thor. But why would there be one just like it here in Vanaheim? It wasn't a traitor when they lived here. Something happened. To them. What? Like an explosion? It have to be you. Doesn't like us invading his territory. I see an altar up there. If we can reach it, we can change the time of day. Typically, those weak spots come in threes. Maybe there's another somewhere around here. This valley was destroyed by my spirit. It was torn, split in two. Part of me. It lies out there with my remains. Perhaps if a scroll was whole again, it would uncloud my mind. I could find peace. 
What do you want, spirit? I was... a scroll. There was... a message I must deliver. The Aesir. And Thor. I, I must remember. The message must be delivered. It was important. My commander is waiting on my word. He's been waiting a while, then. Tell us. What is the last thing you remember? I was seeing red. With anger. At the Aesir. And there were these... red trees. Please, help me regain my memory. Then I can tell you what I know of that day. This specter may be able to tell us what happened in this valley, brother. If the Leviathan froze that lightning, do you think Mother was, you know, here? It means nothing. We do not know that Faye was here. True. But that frozen bolt tells an unfinished story. If we want to know what really happened here, we need to know what that spirit remembers. Hmm. Then we go. the sun and moon. Dragons in Midgard. They were nice. They were also intelligent dwarves who had been transformed oh. into dragons. Still.
that about? Maybe that journal he dropped could tell him it's written by Birka. Well, perhaps that's who this fella has it out for. Isn't that interesting? What is it? Haven't a clue. Hence the interest. Still, crystals are valuable. Perhaps we'll find a use for it. Got him cornered! to find Birger. We should see if there are other dragons to hunt out in the crater. They're gonna be, you know, healing the realm. One of Nicole's children! Put that in the trap! <laughs> Mean to scare you or anything. You did not. Right. Uh you can bring that back to Ratatos group whenever you're ready. Over here. Oh, many thanks. No, thank you. You saved us back on the boat. Right, Father? It was foolish. And appreciated. There's a mystic gateway nearby. But I have no stone for it. We do. I can't believe you survived that fall. How'd you do it? I rolled. <laughs> Talk later. I'll see you back at the camp. And under different circumstances, one hopes. Big Bang! 
Sandman. Well, with boss needs safe, your help coaxing this tag back to the world we'll tree. Explore some the more. boss you needs your it. help, mind you. Not me. I'm doing great. Got a belly full of stag feed. Living life, but yeah. Talk to him back at the round between rounds when you got a moment. Another one of those mysterious crystals. No doubt about it. Just like the frozen lightning bolt in Midgard. Yet I have never been here. Serious. <sighs> Something is wrong with this kill. Dragons do not leave marks like these. We've seen those marks before in the Valander mines, remember? Must be a soul eater around here. I can hear the animals. They're afraid. Aye, let's keep a lookout for other kills. Soul eaters hide in plain sight. Another kill. It's a sign we're on the right trail. We're getting close. I remember last time it looked just like a pile of rocks at first. Stay alert. Aye, some rocks are not like the others. <gasps> Steal yourselves. in this valley can flourish again. I'm sure Anvari would be happy we killed another one at least. Anvari, the dwarf who put his soul into a ring. That's right. He created the Soul Eaters. Whatever happened to the annoying bugger anyway? I lent him to Sindri and he said he lost him. Uh-huh. Lost him. We got more lip flapping to do or no? What you need now?
Ready when you are. Want to yet before you head off? Heimdall is dead. Good. Is it? Look, I don't know from faith, but I know Heimdall was a prize-winning taint stain with a capital stain. If he was gonna hurt your boy, it's a good thing he ain't around no more. The Norns didn't quite see it that way. The opinion of them three shut-in spinsters ain't worth a goat fart in a hurricane. You did what you did. No need to fret about it. I wanted to tell you. I read something in Odin's library about what Galahorn is supposed to do. If blown by a god, it sounds through all the realms, and harmonizes the space between them. Blow it somewhere like Tyr's temple, and it would be like opening up all the realm travel towers at once. It's quite a vulnerability. Wonder why he didn't just destroy it. Some artifacts defy destruction. Well, we should make Freya aware of this. as well speak the tree has become rather overgrown and and if it grows too wildly the branches risk getting too heavy and falling which is not ideal considering they hold all the realms i am no gardener what an absolute shock no i do not require any horticultural skills from you but i would ask that you keep an eye open for the stags of the four seasons they normally graze upon the tree and keep it tidy Unfortunately, Bitter decided it would be funny to trick Arrogant into releasing them. If you happen to find the stags during your travels, I would greatly appreciate assistance in bringing them home. I would have one of my spectral squirrels do it, but they, well, keep eating the feed I give them. Consequence of it being the most delicious food in all the Nine Realms, I suppose. We have seen these stags. Great! Then all you need is some feed. Once you've found a stag, the feed should calm them down. Then, one of my spectrals will guide them back here. And, uh, don't eat the feed, please. I will not. Bitterness asked me if I was too chicken to release them. But I am, in fact, not chicken-like whatsoever. Here's what I So, thought. as you can see, I have no choice. Yes, of course. What else did you have done? This one has a strong personality. Good thing I've got experience with those. Mm. So... This whole spectral squirrel business. You can shoot out your feelings into little ghosties. I suppose that is a slightly inelegant way of putting it. These spectral versions of myself are 
aspects of my personality that I often find distracting at best. My ability not only lets me cast them away and provide some temporary peace of mind, it also allows me to see what goes on outside the tree. Why not just go look yourself? As the eternal caretaker of the tree, I may not leave its confines, all part of the deal, but worth it for the immortality and such. My spectral form still allow me to see the outside world, albeit through slightly colorful viewpoints. That's one word for it. That bitter form of yours is a nasty piece of work. I'm standing right here, you know, that freak. <sighs> I'd apologize for him, but where would it end? Well, I mustn't keep you further from your goings on. Yes, we'll be moving along the Spear would do the trick. Well, happy Ragnarok, everybody! Let's drink. Is it true? Heimdall's dead. I can't believe it. There's no stopping it now. Odin swore peace only so long as you spilled no more Aesir blood. I refused that deal. Yet he honored it. But now. But what? You and I know better than anyone that Odin's promises never last. We have the advantage now. It's time to bring him down. No. None of you understand what's coming. Odin's vengeance will be his only concern. Not his only concern. The mask. Whatever knowledge it unlocks, that's what Odin wants more than anything. If I go back to Asgard, go I can't... Go back. Go back. Look. If I can finish what I started there, awaken the mask, get answers, maybe that's our way out of this. But I gotta go soon. Before they figure out what's happened. Trace, you are home. Do not ask me to put you at risk again. He's at risk where he stands, Kratos. We all are. Anything we do or don't do is dangerous right now. But Odin needs me. He trusts me. I'll be safe there. From a tactical perspective, am I wrong? I don't much like it. But it is our best play. Dividing Odin's focus would buy us time. And give us a pair of eyes in the enemy's inner sanctum. But if there is truly a source of infinite knowledge, you can't let Odin have it. Aye. And once he has what he needs from you, then I lose my leverage. I get it. I'll be smart. Father. I can do this. Remember our promise. You too. Mm -hmm. I hope you know what you're doing. I do too, Sam. Well, I still want to hear how you did it. You mean how we did it? Ah, you heard me. And therein lies a tale. Atreus, listen. I can't let you go back without this. A hammer? Your key, please. You ever need a way out of a bad situation? Throw this down hard and say, Wergi. 
One use only. Wergi. Thanks, Sindri. Hope I don't need it. Me too. All right. Odin said Hugin would be waiting in the cabin. Mimir, anything else I should know about Odin? Maybe a weakness or something? Like if I flip up his eye patch, he'll disintegrate. I lad, wouldn't that be? Yeah, no. Sorry, Mimir. I can't do your accent. I'm on my own for this one. <sighs> Here we go. Oh, were you having a moment? It sort of looked like you were having a moment. I can go. No. Sorry. This is Fenrir. <laughs> it's okay, Ben. She's, uh... <laughs> <laughs> so, I was right about your knife. Huh? I'm glad you found a place for a soul. <laughs> me too. Hey, uh, how'd you find me here? Loki? This is my marble. And where are you heading off to? Back to Asgard. Hey, I'm actually using him. Uh-huh. Angerboda, look. Once I see this through, I'm gonna know everything. How to save my father, how to stop Ragnarok, and maybe, hopefully, how to bring our people back. Loki, those are all very noble intentions. But he's Odin. You have faith in me, right? Of course I do. I just hope the story you're writing for yourself is the one that you truly want. Would you... Would you take care of Finn while I'm away? I'll take good care of him. Good night, boy. <laughs> Be careful, Loki. Help Odin complete the mask, but also make sure he doesn't get any answers from it. Easy, right? He's probably in a study. Okay. Panic does nothing. Harness it. Heimdall's dead. Happen to know something about that? Anything? Well, I mean, everyone hated them. Sure, sure. But have you seen anything? Something noteworthy? I mean, you know, he did sock through it pretty hard while we were out. Maybe someone found out? Got even? I, I don't know. 
Are you suggesting my son had something to do with this? I don't know. Honest. Well, I have to ask. Never believed you had anything to do with this. I'm glad you're back. So, I figured out what went wrong. I mistranslated a word here. Did you now? I thought it said beyond the cry of cold breath, but it actually reads the cry of first breath. Well, that's somewhere else entirely. I know where that is. Young man, you've done it again. Go. Take the mask, take the sword, take the bird. Find Thor. We're going to Niflheim. Too. Hey, Ingrid, you wouldn't happen to know where Thor is. Yeah, I figured. Through? Sorry, um, all Father said I'm supposed to head to Niflheim with your dad. I haven't seen him around, and I was wondering if you had any idea where he could be. He wasn't with Grandfather? No. I think I know where he might be. Follow me. I, uh, also wanted to talk to you about Heimdall. Don't. Not here. You're right. Later. Shut it. Back in Helheim, I told you I'd help your mom understand how much becoming a Valkyrie meant to you. I wanted to, uh... Let you know that I meant it. You didn't. And you're still alive? I haven't yet, but I will. As soon as I come back. <laughs> There'll be plenty of time to get under her skin later. Thanks, Loki. Weapons aren't allowed inside. We'll have to check them. Why? Just do it. Come on, this way. Oh. Huh. Come on, they're not gonna let you in otherwise. Look around, he'll be here. Hey, Thor. Seems like it might be a bad time, so... If you need a moment, I totally understand. No rush, but... Uh... Right where I thought you'd be. Why you to be here? You shouldn't be here. shouldn't have brought her here. What are you doing? Relaxing. Did I say no rush? I meant we should get going, right? We don't want to keep the Allfather... Quiet! He's right. You should get going. <laughs> Don't do this. It's already done. Let it be known, the God of Thunder is good for two things. Killing giants and pissing me! Any man who disagrees will greet Mjolnir with his face. This isn't you. 
Thor. <clears throat> Hugin is waiting outside. Please, let's just... I said, quiet, boy. My name is... <laughs> Uh... What? No, I... Oh, come on! No, 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 I swear that really wasn't... That's enough! Oh, I've missed this! Andy.
it again. Right now, just put down the... <sighs> Grab his arms. Let's get him out of here. It's a good fight. <gasps> <clears throat> <clears throat> I'm sorry you had to see him like this. No, no, it's fine, really. Hey, I'm strong, but you gotta help me out here. Come on, it's not that far. You are going to Niflheim with Loki. All father's orders. You have to get up. I know you're disappointed. Disappointed? No, 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 no. That was a glorious fight. You can't even say you're sorry this time, can you? Because what's one more broken promise? Grandfather treated you like crap. You were struggling. I get it. But you can't just... <sighs> we're here for you. Mom and I are here for you. Even when you're here. We love you. You know that. I just thought this was behind us. I fucked up. or something. Fine. Let's make this quick. You in a hurry to get back to Asgard? Just get us to that mask piece. Was it worth it? I don't know what you're talking about. Fine, but I hope you know what seeing you like that did to me. I was drunk, not blind. Why can't we just fly over these guys straight to the mat? You think I want to carry you all that way? You're strong! I'm not your pack horse. <laughs> Too easy. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
Take care of this one, Loki. Yup! Who looks up to you? I hope you know that. Don't need a lecture about parenting from you. Just find the thing. Looks like we gotta head through that wall. Do you Something wanna... I need to do first. Take your time. Now we can go. Yep. Loki, you really keep trying to... I don't even know what you're trying to do anymore, but you have no idea the kind of shit I've been through. Right. Have giant son of a powerful god with impossibly high expectations. How could I ever know what that's like? Neat trick. Yep. trying to do anything. I'm just pointing out we're not that different. I got no interest in bonding over shared blood. <laughs> Another wall of ice. Hmm. Thor, mm -hmm. could you... Okay, I just want to add one more thing. If you can't be yourself, you also might not feel like you can follow your own path. Doesn't sound familiar to you at all? You take this, Where are you going? So we've got some similar life experience. What does it matter? Seems stupid to gripe about the things we can't change. Who says we can't? Ah! 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 
We're far from Ivaldi's workshop, right? Far enough. Again with the griping. Calling out a problem isn't griping. It's healthy. I bet you're glad I'm helping so much this time around. You're welcome. I will say the sword's doing work over there. You're lucky she tells you to. Too. Too. Just ahead. This will be fun. I don't think that's where we're supposed to go. So, I said it'd be fun. It was. <laughs> Say when you see them again. Sif and Throod, I mean. If all fathers pleased, it doesn't matter. Look, I don't need you to solve my family problems for me. Just find the mask. Let's get out of here. Up this way. Looks like there's a path. One pathway coming up. You enjoying the freedom? Out here without Fabio. I, uh, well, yeah, I guess. It's different from what I'm used to, in a good way. Looks like we gotta get up that cliff. Guy thinks we No thinking. <laughs> it's better when I know it's gonna happen. <laughs> Close. Uh, maybe. I can check. You take this one, 
kid. Thor, I, um, hope everything goes okay when you see Sif and Thud again. Well, hoping is better than thinking. It's a start. It's here. Gotcha. Phew. That was close. Um, thanks, Thor. Wasn't about to lose that. Loki, we did it. We are on the verge of great things, all of our work together. You're welcome. I'm sorry. You are here. Why? His father murdered Heimdall. For said he has proof. Take him. No. Leave him alone. I command it. You said no more Aesir blood would be spilled. You said family comes first. You don't think that this is retribution for him being here? He's put your granddaughter in danger. He's made your son miserable. Loki didn't kill Heimdall. His father did. Your daughter is old enough to make her own mistakes. And your husband started drinking again all on his own. Dismissed! You two, a word. Can't you see what's happening? He's not protecting us. Magni, Modi, our boys. We used to tell them stories by the fire. Do you remember? We would carve those wooden horses. We would play and laugh until the sun sank and they fell asleep in our laps. They were thrown at the All Father's problems like brittle knives to a mountain face. And for what? What if Thrut's next? My father against me. My daughter. I have no idea what's happening. You know, I finally thought of something I can teach you. Hey, you stand me. down! Sentry better be right. Where are you? Sentry. Ah! 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 You sure know how to plan an exit. Atreus. <sighs> Glad you're safe, lad. Got out just in time. Pretty sure I burned my bridges in Asgard, though. Wait, why were you out here? Sindri told us where you would arrive should you find trouble. Oh, thought you might have been exploring without me. No, lad. Your dad was just concerned. Though, now that you mention it... Mimir. Brother, please. It's all so crowded and tense back home. Don't you miss the three of us out finding our own adventures? Putting off the inevitable. Exactly. It's not the worst idea. I do want to show everyone the mask, but it'll keep. Hmm.
rest can wait. Thank you, brother. Back to the crater. We still have unfinished business there. The wayward spirit of the crater may still have more to tell us. Sounds good. Another crystal. Best uh. hold on to it until we can figure out what to do with it. <laughs> what a shame. A river once ran through here, bringing life to all manner of flora and fauna. What became of the river? Odin had something to do with it, didn't he? Aye. Damned it up. I'd bother fighting the enemy if you can just get rid of their water source. Something rather large broke through here. Stay alert. <sighs> so, which is your favorite of Gavassia's poems, brother? Why would I choose a favorite? Headed the right way. Inasmuch as hurtling headlong into a ravenous beast maw could be considered the right way. Wogan! <laughs> we can't get through with that bastard trying to budget us! Then we must get closer!
Dead end. Where to now? I'll be damned. That was a joke, guys. Are you certain? I thought it was funny. Let's go investigate, shall we? Bloody Odin. We could likely reach the other side of this canyon if there was still water running through it. In the dam, you think we bring the river back? I wonder what's in there. <laughs> Look, another one of those day night altars. Probably need to use it, I'm guessing. A lift. I wonder if this will take us to the dam. The thought of the creatures here dying of thirst. It just... It makes me mad. Harness that. But do not let it control you. Say the... Alka! Right side, brother. <laughs> say they're doing here? Some Vanir turned to dark magic to defend themselves from the Aesir. Well, <laughs> What's it say, brother? <laughs> Another mystery crystal. <gasps> Another Drekki. It'll eat its way through everything here. Let's track it down. Lewdly, I 
I had my style me. And uh, I was excited. Yes. About to bury the hatchet with an old friend. But something terrible happened. I'm afraid that terrible thing was your demise, my friend. I know there was more. Three parts. I could see all three. Please, help me make amends with my friend. Help me remember. I've got a good feeling about this guy. I think he knows something about Mother. Or not. Have some faith, brother. Answers could be closer than you think. Out! Something's gummed up the works, brother. <laughs> ah, there's still a blockage further up there. Surely that's unjammed the wheel. Hmm. The water's moving. I wonder if we can get anywhere new now. Huh. The water level. I think we can go across now. I am ready to drink in the next life. That's where the Drekki feed. Let's get ready. Won't be much time for fussing once the fighting starts. Ready yourselves. I got you. Bloody oh. luck. Oh. Another one. Oh. 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 I felt that one, brother.
Shazam unblocked. But Risha Strecky dead. I'd say this jungle is well on its way back to its original glory. Look, over here, the water's flowing. You got the water flowing. Only so we might access more of the crater. Yeah, but with the water flowing, the plants and animals will come back. I think we just healed this place. It was not my intention. For goodness sake, brother, just take the win. With the water flowing and new paths open to us, I say we go for a stroll. We will search. Not stroll. Oh, come off it. You've never enjoyed nature for its own sake? Not just for the treasure you might find? I mean, treasure is nice too. You're hopeless. Both of you. Looks like our good deed has already brought back some wildlife. But... Suppose I spoke too soon. Dragon's perched on that structure. Should we find a way up? If we keep going this way, I believe we'll reach that air dragon's lair. Yes. Just making sure you know where you're going. Thank you. I have to get past those vines somehow. Trying to bludge us! Then we must get closer! If we go much further, we'll be right on top of the ogre. Better be sure we're ready. We fight! Yeah! I got that! 
Was ours, you opportunistic sod. It went back to his perch. Let's go after it. Unless my eyes deceive me, that seems to be the stag of summer. Is it hot or is it just my sizzling personality? Nah, it's you, Stag. And we go already? Mm. That's right, we got more food at home. Come on! I have to say, quite a nice change of pace helping these stags get home. For a moment, I was worried we'd have to kill them. Yes. You had a plan to kill it if it had attacked, didn't you? Yes. It's good. Well, it's fine. <clears throat> Path's open. That dragon is shaking in its scaly boots, I suspect. Once we approach the dragon, we will kill or be killed. Understood? Yes, Father. Come on! Ogre's not getting up anytime soon, either. I can hear the animals. They're relieved. Maybe they'll come out of hiding. That's say we put something of a dent in the dragon population of this crater. I can already hear the difference. The prey animals. They're a lot less scared.
I got the sense Vanaheim wasn't supposed to be so humid. Was that the effect of Fimblewinter there? To a great extent, it seems. So Midgard had endless night and cold. Svartalfheim had earthquakes. Alfheim had the light randomly pulsing. But Asgard didn't seem to be having any effects at all. Odin had a long time to prepare. No change I noticed in Helheim or Muspelheim either. Now that I think of it, the more primordial realms might be less susceptible. How do you suppose Jotunheim is faring? Uh, how would I know? Just training your powers of speculation. I don't know. If nobody's there to see, does it even matter? The Stag of Winter. It looks hungry. Come on already! Just come back with me! I don't care how hungry you are! Oh. Halfway there, by Septimus! I do not like you. I get that a lot. Two down, halfway there. Brothers, how did you manage to kill Garm anyway? We killed him a few times, actually, but it didn't take. And I figured maybe the way to stop a soulless beast was to give it a soul. So I gave it the one I had on me. I beg your pardon? Fenrir, remember the light Father saw? The accidental magic I did when Fenrir died? That was part of Fenrir's soul going into my knife. Once I figured that out, I just put... Fenrir into Garm. <laughs> Clever one, lad! A gigantic hell beast with the soul of a loyal pup. What a brilliant! Amir, did you know Garm? How was he locked up to begin with? Ah, Hell's Feral Sentinel. Well, believe it or not, Midgard was once bigger. Until Garm, then just a wee pup, got peckish. He ate Midgard? Only a few mountain ranges. And the fifth season that comes after winter but before spring. 
And the word for the feeling when you get so hungry, you stop being hungry. You're messing with me. I would never. So, Mimir, how did they capture Garm in the first place? That was Tears doing. He lured the beast somewhere safe and kept it distracted by lending his own arm to be gently chewed. Once the chains were on and the gate to Elheim was opened, Garm bit Tears' arm clean off in retribution. But Tears not missing an arm. Well, it grew back, eventually. He is a very resourceful god, after all. Brother, what you said before about the oracles of your lands being fooled by their own prophecies, I get the sense that was coming from personal experience, eh? Yes, but enough of that for now. <laughs> It does not matter. Doesn't it? If rage is all that remains, her reasons are irrelevant. Another gathering of Sather. You know what you have to do, brother? Release them. Say they're out here. I wonder if Freya knows why. Got him. Another one already? Great. Why exactly do you keep popping up, little one? Does your boss have you spying on us? No, 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 that wasn't our intention. You must believe me, I am here solely to serve as a guide, but, but only if you want. It's standard procedure. Well, you can rest easy. We'll get these back to Ratatoska. Thank you. And again, sorry if I offended you. I, I promise I'll be more helpful next time. Jumpy little fella, huh?
father's new spear. It's made out of a ring? Drop me an eye. Forged by the Hulder brothers as a gift for Odin. How's it work? Every so often, the Dropnir drips out identical copies of itself. The Huldras presumably figured that if one golden ring was a good gift, an infinite number of them would earn them a permanent place in Odin's heart. But it didn't. Not even a little. 